friends, Big River here. Uh, I'm still in Sweden doing some integration work after my ISTA level two. <coughs> I just wanted to share with you a little bit of what I'm working on today. Experience that really hit me to my deepest, deepest core. Um, during ISTA level two, there's this ceremony, a rebirthing ceremony. I won't share the details of the ceremony, but more like my story around it. Because you see, those of you who've watched me know I was an orphan. And I never was held by my birth mother. Um, she was a teenage girl. They, in those days, they just took the baby away. They didn't. They thought it was unhealthy for the like a mother-child bond when they give it up for adoption. So I never had that. So here I am at the end of this rebirthing ceremony, and this goddess is holding me as if I'm her child and just held me in her breasts and I'm looking up at her big beautiful blue Viking eyes with all the love and compassion that she has as this this divine mother just welcoming me in and it it hit me so hard oh my god it hit me so hard so this is what I'm integrating today and I should give you a little backstory I guess this woman <laughs> When I met her, she was pregnant with her youngest son that she has now, and um, she just radiated. She had this life in her womb, and she was a celebration of herself and this life she was carrying, and it was so fucking awesome and impressive. I just couldn't help but fall in love with this woman. Just like, wow, just wow, wow. And over the years, I've been, you know, we've been friends, and I've been like watching her and, and actually last, last year when her son was hospitalized, I was with her in the hospital and I saw a mother in the worst of times and that love and compassion. And <clears throat> now here's this woman holding me. And this woman is like the epitome of like a Viking goddess. She's strong and won't take shit and will tell you exactly what she thinks. And then she just flows with the divine feminine and like, just radiates the sexual confidence and just like, just, just wow, wow. And here is this beautiful goddess holding me, welcoming me into this new life. In a way I've never really been held before. You know, I've held, you know, lovers and I've held intimately, but even, even, but I've never was held at birth like that. And here I was being held by this woman who's the epitome of like uh, just epitome of a goddess holding me in her big blue eyes staring at me welcoming me and that's gonna be something that I'm gonna I'm gonna take that I gotta integrate this some more I just had to share that little story with you but I'm still integrating this what this means to me and I'm gonna take it and run with it and create something even more amazing than I have been creating and just so these are tears of joy I, I felt something I've never felt before and um, I just had to share it with all of you thank you for listening and um, I'll see you again soon okay oh